incredible. It was another beautiful sunset. And in this home, there are two of us that run to each other and say, come, 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 don't miss the sunset, don't miss the sunset. So here, listen to this one. It was the sun herself who came to tell me about the beautiful sunset today. She is a soul disguised in the body of a child. Her rays extend out to the sky. I am so fortunate to live under the same sky as her and the sun. The sun will slowly set, but the extensions of her rays glow on. The shapes of the clouds in the sky, their color, their vicinity to each other. I wish I knew what each was thinking. The one behind whom is hiding the sun. The game of peekaboo. There is no hiding when you reach the sky. Don't hide from yourself behind the clouds. That might be them. I heard the elevator, but we'll see. Oh, sorry. There is indeed a tranquility in the sky. The peace I feel from the color of the sea. There is no cave for me to hide. My feelings are bare without disguise. Another drop of water ripples in the sky. The ripples of water in the sky are beautiful. And now I only see the shyness of the sun. It is her left cheek which has blushed. She too will embrace the coming of the moon. The moon that is but a crescent among the clouds. Tonight, I will stay up to watch the dance of the moon playing with the clouds. The seagulls hear the call to prayer as I do. There were some seagulls in the sky at sunset and I could see them, feel them, hear the call to prayer. I get up from where I've watched the clouds all the long. I open the window and long to fly with seagulls as they pray. Allah, Allahu Akbar. I bow my head, I hold my head. The heaviness of my thoughts wears me down. When can I be free of the web of lies? It is then that I will fly as I pray among the clouds. 